Oranus oh, okay. again. Yeah, Elanian, sure. It makes sense. Maybe, maybe I would like to see Gaia. Yeah. Whoa, oh, Kronos. here goes Kronos. There you go. Okay. Kronos or Gaia. You can't go wrong. I'm at it. I right. feel like uh, Kronos and Gaia are better than Oranos on the water maps. Yes, I agree. Um, for sure. And Gaia on Extended Edition can give you a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot uh, of uh, options. Anyway, let's get into the game. Yeah, I've heard Gaia on PvE, if I'm not mistaken, stronger than Vuvu. Yes. I'm not Vuvu guy. Okay, so we see for the third straight time, we see the same as the god. Uh, nice once again. Oh, you can use decoys or water uh, for your uh, war canoes. Wow. Yes. That's actual. Man, that's, that's borderline yeah. broken. <laughs> so, has, has, I would say, is the best on that. Okay, imagine <laughs> having ships that you just walk around and oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> that that would hurt for the for any opponent. Anyways. Oh, yeah. Um so uh, yeah, you were saying we gotta get some more uh some more um attention to the Civ and more matches. We can do another show match before the tournament mm -hmm. that's going to be announced. Mm -hmm. um, for anyone who's listening, there's going to be a tournament for 2,300 or plus players or higher players on uh, EVE. Um, Return of the Gods is only on EVE. It's only on Extended Edition. So uh, we'll have a tournament in June for it, and we can do another show match before then if we want. Okay, so there is this uh, ad, uh, <clears throat> Asi Huatl. Yeah, Asi Huatl. Okay, this, this can fight, right? Uh, in the classic ones, yeah. Okay. A little bit. It's not very uh, tanky. Oh, Flames is doing an Oracle Hero. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's just denying the dog that... together. But we'll deny the talk. A warrior priest will come to save the day, but no, no, That's don't huge. lose the commoner. Please don't lose the commoner. I think okay. he won't. He saved it. The warrior priest. But look at all this. Look at all this uh, idle time that he causes. Yeah. Kronos. <laughs> yeah, but now flames will have to gather also gold in order to build the temple. He will be late. Advancing. It's a big investment to make a, a scout into a hero, probably. Okay, he's forcing also the water priest to go back. That was smart, keeping the warrior priest nearby for the healing. Okay, Flames is not making any other steps. He's as of uh, anti raider is fighting now with the shadow nice. fighter and the yeah. hero i think if he puts them on the wood line and anti raider really recovered from that quickly mm -hmm. he's building up the temple um also now temple coming up for flames really nice Uh, but Flames doesn't have as many fishing boats. You see, uh, Anti-Raider has already six. And he has also clicked up 6%. Okay, we see the same uh, god being reached. Yeah, but you would have thought, you would have thought that uh, Flames would age up first before. Yeah, Anti-Raider is going up first. Um, I want to see what the plan will be for Flames. I feel like he should make a couple of more Oracles in order to have 
also the Valord and he can proxy make a couple by hand, by choosing. So he can push with like five oracles plus a Promethean. Right. So well, he'll make a bunch of Prometheans see. and uh, yeah, a few hero oracles. Continue the aggression ASAP. We see the hero and the shadow. He needs a second attack. dock. I don't think that he will make a second dock anytime soon, though. He could have made it when he was aging up. Okay, now he's uh, he clicked to make a second one in order to push uh, on the docks and build in the back. Really nice. Okay, the war canoe is there to defend. Really nice job yeah. from uh, Anti Raider. Oh, he's using the uh, Asiwako too. Yeah, so we'll do a little Also, the hero and the runner are uh, decoys. Some, yeah, yeah, the eco in the back and the gold. Really nice job. I feel like I feel like Anti Raider. He's in a commanding spot right now. Once again, yeah. Look at all those war canoes. He's he's pop uh, popped them. Need some houses. He's not building houses. Yeah. Let's get some houses. There we go. Two more runners being uh, created, uh, being spawned on the base of flames, but they are forced to go back. And look at all those uh, canoes. I mean, some of them are decoys, the four of them are decoys, but still, those units need to die first. Yeah. Uh, and flames will have a hard time uh, microing all those. It's even more confusing on meta, I think, because yeah, yeah, they're it's exactly the same shit every time. Of course, they you have to micro this. You have to micro this exceptionally well. Yeah. So even more war canoes in the back for anti raider. He right um, now has fifteen of them without the decoys. Okay. The deconstruction on the second dock. I feel like the dock will eventually go down, but the hero is there to clean the things up. And now we have a bunch of Byrims created for the flames. Uh, he got them out of the of the dock. Nice, that's good. He's getting some... Oh, he's opting for fishing ships. I don't know if he wants to do that now. Yeah, I'm not sure either. Uh, yeah. Some of those are decoys. Yeah, yeah, so... <laughs> yeah, Flames needs to micro this really oh, well. Wood, uh, yep, I see that. Uh, he got one villager for the price uh, of one oracle. And a couple Prometheans. So the, in the water right now, the, we have a big fight. Uh, we see some the war canoes cleaning up the whole medit right now. Almost. Hunter was able again. Yeah, he was able to get three dogs. Anti Raider will uh, have a good line of defense there with a third dog if it goes up. Okay. Okay, that so now it's two dogs. But and now uh, anti raider is trying is to now do. that yeah. Sorry, what were you gonna say? Oh no no, please proceed. No, the thing is now that anti raider has his uh, his fisherman out, it flames doesn't so much. Mm -hmm. He's got how many fishermen? Anti Raider is housed yet again. This is going to come back and hurt him actually right now because he needs the pop. Yeah. 
and been really he's, falling he's behind the houses. Lose. Yeah, he's starting to lose now on water, and it's going to come back and hurt him. We don't oh, know. Oh wow! Yet. Yeah, it just because of the houses. Yes. Completely because of the house, and you don't want the Atlantia player, uh, generally speaking, to get control of the meta. You cannot really let him um, uh, get all that uh, free food for himself. So maybe it'd be best if he just went heroic at this point. Yeah, he's gathering the resources in order to go. He's also getting some uh, chickens uh, some chicken food he is able to defend though with some uh, automated knights plus the hero on land he... and uh, he got uh, the Tianguis and he's now getting the craftsman guild is it required to build both in order to advance? Right, you need the Craftsman's Guild to get heroic, it's the Aztec Armory. Okay. Okay, so the temple is being shifted back. Also now, uh, Flames is getting the Armory. I would like to see him get a second TC. Also yep. in order to get uh, even further ahead. Now would be and a good time, for sure. Let's see the god of choice for each player. Uh, because we'll uh, have so we got Hyperion for um, Flames and Cheap A token. He's, for he's, throwed, he's throwing air. down two military barracks. Uh, so this god is with the Night Winds. Okay. This is a very... Honestly, this is a very... Um, Annoying got power to play against the night winds. Uh, it's like I I wouldn't mind using it on someone else, but for sure I wouldn't like it if it was casted on my army. Because you have to move him so quickly. Like if you just give it a few seconds and you aren't you're not paying attention, your whole army yeah. just gets wiped. So maybe it could have more of like an audio alert or something. Oh, something. look at this raid on the back of the wood line of flames. Oh, yeah. Looking good. One citizen will be killed. Oof. Another one. You see all those few free shadows come out. Mm hmm. For the. Yep, no, no, mm -hmm. They use chaos on that. I don't know if that's worth. I think it's worth it because right now the Chaos units will follow uh, the units of Anti-Raider on water. We have a little bit of a fight, but Anti-Raider uh, is losing it despite having four dogs right now. And Flames is uh, freely right now creating units without uh, having anything bother him on the wood line while gathering gold. On the front, he's still way behind the population that I think he should be. Oh, but Anerator has three TCs now. Mm hmm. Uh, yeah, he has three TCs. He's has... missed... still, is he still one. one? Mm hmm. I don't think one. he scouted his third TC as well. Yeah, his third TC should be by the, this black. Uh, area on the wood line. Yeah. He will try to move uh, forward his units. Thing is that anti raider he's being so much uh, committing on water that he doesn't have any uh, military units on land right now. He has only the Queen Ahmed. Queen Ahmed. The Kimi. The Kimi Ahmed. Okay, to defend, but he will have... Oh, don't tell me those night winds are also working on sea. Yeah. Okay, really nice. And you see the area of effect. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
flames right now can just uh, deny the whole gold on the right and i think he will throw down a market at some point but look at this go to his second pc the chaos units came back to hurt him they oh, killed no. two citizens no two way citizens were trying to get the town really? center that's actually hilarious to, that's to even so think bad, about dude. he's oh getting God. oh my he's getting some remillos in the back to that sucks. Oh that sucks really, really hard. Yeah. Oh, and so we, now we got some siege canoes coming out. Okay, and we see. Yeah, he's kind of like suiciding them though. Yeah, they su he's suiciding them on the docks and all those by reams. I would like to see if Flames is going mythic with Helios. Okay. Why Helios though? I would like to see Atlas. Atlas here can be devastating. Oh yeah? I mean, he's going Helios for the Mana War. I can understand that, but Man -war. Atlas... Yeah, the myth unit. Yeah, uh, but what, how, how good is that going to be though? I mean, he will clear up the, whole, the entire water. This unit is uh, bonkers strong. Is it? Okay. I thought it was too weak or something. No, no, no. It's, uh, it's really good. Okay. Hyperion also gave him access to night raids, but uh, he he has two night raids right now out. He really wants the water. He really wants water in order for him to be able to oh, for sure. e even up the eco difference. I like seeing the night the raids come out. You, you don't see it very often. Mm hmm. <clears throat> So that's definitely helping them out. And, uh, Some prisoners being bought uh, for uh, anti raider. We so will probably, see them right yeah. now. We see them right now being uh, sacrificed by the temple. Oh yeah, from the Tianguis it has to be. So, okay, he wants favor. Wants favor, but his ecos. He's lost. He's losing the water, and he's not getting enough gold either. He's just getting back on the gold. Helios right now has been researched for uh, flames. He will be good. able. He will be able to get the the water. With uh, the man of war, he will destroy all docks. I think I see that uh, anti raider is not bothering anymore with uh, water. I feel like he should do that. A long time ago. Now we see the third PC for uh, flames being scouted. <laughs> um... Okay, so both players right now don't they don't have eco upgrades. Why? Oh, oh look at this chaos. This chaos was huge. Where? Uh, he got the chaos by the seashore there on the left, and he got the heroic aids um, myth unit, the stone thrower, that, as I would like to say, with some auto middle knights. And we have now the Helios being used on the left side. You see, I feel like flames doesn't want to give up. He wants to go for a, at least a game number four. He definitely, um, I think he, he played this game well, overall. Even so though he was down TCs, he did exactly what he was supposed to do by uh, pushing Andy Raider off of gold there. Not letting him uh, get ahead, eco-wise. Oh yeah, he got uh, Makina Metley, I see it now. Yeah, it's, uh, and some auto knights. Yeah, that's, uh, that hurts that's actually. Anti Raider is missing some houses. Okay, you see now water has been taken care of. I would like to see salt down for uh, for uh, flames. I would like to see eco upgrades in general. He has just handaxe and pickaxe. Yeah, I, I see that. You and cannot now, uh, rely on flames or uh, anti raiders. Eco seems to be stabilizing despite not having water. I think the 
chaos has been dealt with almost. Mm, still one chaos left and two vortex god powers left. We see the god, the vortex used on the right, so he wants to go for the right side DC this time. I like what Anti Raider is doing with the walls actually in order to get some map control, free map control on the left, while he has done this to defend on the right. But this DC is going to be down for sure. Wow, Flames is, is not. Flames should uh, probably try to build on the other side now while this is going on. Yeah, he can also shift the buildings if he really wants to. Yeah. Yeah, shift so them. now we will have a fight, and he's bringing also the boats. I like this. Also, the boats are doing a lot of that. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Yeah, you could just stand by them. Right there. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Oh, oh the, and uh, then. Shift block. The, the shift oh, block and then. The units. The Heka Gigantes just played him dirty there. Just put the the units on the other yeah, side. Yeah, put them to safety, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, but now flames. That was a nice uh, building block there. For sure, for sure, he got a lot of damage on those units. He's getting the fourth DC with five citizens. Five citizens. I think this is going up. Yeah, uh, for sure for uh, flames. He has some idle army in the back. Okay, now he notices. He got soft mine though, and he's okay. Both players. Four to see now. Yeah. Four, four to both, play play both players are, are trying to get uh, equal upgrades, but I think for anti raiders a little bit too little too late with the upgrades. If he had gotten the upgrades early on when they were fighting like. Uh, crazy on the water and he just went three TCs. I feel like that was the turning point of this okay. whole game. Gotcha. Well, the houses, I think, are really different. Yeah, houses. for sure. Uh, uh, at the start, yes, but as the as long as, the, as far as the game has gone, I feel like uh, Anti Raider still had the chance to win this uh, when he went to 3 TCs, but he never invested in Eco. We see now investing in Eco. Now he's getting okay. irrigation. Now he's getting carpenters. Gotcha. Now he's getting more uh, prisoners. He got to Mythic Age though. Right, so there's okay. Um I'm not Even sure some how good that's going to be now though. Okay, give me some info about this god. Yeah, so Tlalo Khan, so Tlalo Khan uh, gives you plus 10 population. It mm -hmm. allows you to train the Tlalo Kamith unit, which is Tlalo Smith's unit, 10% uh, cheaper from it. And it takes prisoners for increased favor as well. Oh, he got chaos, it right? It, and then lastly, it blocks god powers. And it's not. Oh, really? Yes. And you can use it on water too. So instead mm -hmm. of uh, capturing prisoners like it does on land, on water you can use it to heal your naval units. Okay. For what it's worth. Okay, I don't see anti raider coming back actually in this game. Yeah, Flames is also building a palace by the right side DC. Nine of the right side gold mine and whatever operation this governor is trying to do. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, this uh, Talokan is the, the god power, right? Right. So it just stays there permanently? It's like a mm -hmm. honey bowl that can be captured. Okay. Anti Raider has a lot of eco though, but you cannot go up against the uh, the spam of any Atlantean player that has a hundred and eighty population card. Yeah, we're all really... out of gold here too. Oh, he's got some gold up there as well. Yeah. yeah. It's looking pretty green. It's pretty green.
some celestial priests in the mix but nothing too nothing too crazy for him i don't see him uh, coming back the dc is being denied just 400 hp before it gets up and so you I see the uh the myth unit the one that's chaotic mm -hmm. and like that that's the twilight king myth unit and that gets trained from the twilight con cheaper than it does from the temple that's what it's going to oh okay so 270 from the Talokan building and 300 from the temple. Right, okay. Cheaper, okay. cheaper favor as well. I Flames is even going for a 50C. Yeah, just uh, finishing up the game. Uh, shifting the tower to. Mm -hmm. Okay, now he started so getting upgrades. See, well played uh, for uh, Flames, and he now was able to push the series into a fourth game. If you like the content, consider subscribing to my YouTube channel. Also, I stream often on Twitch, so. Be, for, be sure to follow there. If you like the content even more, subscribe. As always, stay awesome, guys. See you on Twitch.